that connects neighboring states. This expressway has recorded series of robbery attacks by men of the underworld. However, this time around, the Met via Waterloo has men of the anti-robbery police court killed two highway robbers who specializes in robbing luxurious buses. Upon visiting the police division of headquarters, Ogbere, corpses of the two armed robbers were dumped in front of the police station. Three pump-action rifles, two locally made pistols and machete recovered from them were also on the ground. John Ada is a passenger. He and others speak of their experience, the last of which lasted for over two hours. They said the robbers armed with guns and other dangerous weapons waited in ambush. 2 a.m. in the morning. So the armed robber came out from the bush, started chasing our Rosero's bus. The, the, the try and get the driver pushed out of the stairway. So they escaped with the vehicle and drove us onto the farm road, very far from the Federal Express. They started searching everything thoroughly. They collected all our money, all our belongings. They operate for like two hours to three hours. So for God so kind, the police uh, intervened. We, we heard gunshots and for this morning when we he gave us assurance that they will be caught and we were going to recover all our valuables. To so my surprise this morning, they were, we, we saw two dead bodies and all our valuables have been recovered. And I want to say a big thank you to the DP of Ibarre uh, Station, police, police Division. It's a nice man. We never knew police can respond to situations like this. And we were actually surprised this morning when we saw the dead body and every of our things intact, everything. I maneuver to the other, other side of the road so that I'll be able to escape through one way. But uh, suddenly when I was trying to use reverse to escape, then some guys came up behind me. They hit my vehicle with ammunition. When I wanted to change the gear, maybe by using one to escape again, they rushed into me and I tried to maneuver, which is I escaped. Briefing journalists on the incident at Ogbere Police Station, the Ogun State Police Public Relations Officer Abimbola Oyeyemi said the police got information of the operation. He added that on getting there, the robbers had fled the scene and the police traced them to their hideout, where two of the robbers were shot dead and the other escaped with gunshot wounds. Using this medium to appeal to the hospitals that if they see anybody who comes to them with a bullet wound, they should please quickly alert the police because we are still looking out for them. And uh, I'm very sure we are going to get the remaining Hoodlums. Abimbola Oyeyemi stressed that Ogun State will not be a comfort zone for hoodlums, urging them to turn a new leaf.